So after the last two videos focused on rocket fuel with calcium nitrate rockets and it failing miserably, I decided to use sodium nitrate rockets since they are surprisingly easy and better than calcium nitrate rockets. First we need a proper rocket body and nozzle, which is calculated using the RPA software, which is free and easy to use. It takes account the fuels you're using, as well as chamber pressure and etc. to make the perfect nozzle for you, as well as calculating other useful things such as the optimal ratios and all that good stuff. And now after all of that, we just need to get the parts ready. Thankfully, most of the dimensions that we've calculated here is actually available from the hardware store. So we just need to join them together after purchasing them. Okay. Now for the nozzle, it was a little bit more challenging since we needed to cast and carve the concrete into the correct shape inside the pipe. To do this, I used the tip of my pen as the mold for the diverging part of the nozzle, and then I manually molded the concrete for the uh, converging part of the nozzle. This whole process took about a whole day to model and dry. Next up, the fuel. There were many different ratios to choose from, so I did some calculations of my own, as well as used other sources such as Reddit, Science Madness, and RPA. Unfortunately, since I couldn't find sucrose in RPA's fuel options, I had to do different tests using sucrose versus dextrose. This shows the mass ratios as well as the source slash calculations. Okay, well maybe I'll melt it and then see if it works. Now here's the sodium nitrate to sucrose reactions. Oh, From these tests, I found that it seemed the 7 to 3 nitrates to sucrose ratio was the best. Next, I made a larger batch of this and loaded it into the rocket.
After that disappointing result, I tried it again with some rust added in to catalyze the reaction for a quicker burn. Here's a comparison between one without rust versus one with rust. You can see that even though the one with rust has a larger amount to burn through, it finished at almost the same time as the one without rust. So I packed it in and tried it again. Clearly, it didn't work, so it seems that potassium nitrate is really the best rock candy we can use, as sugar really isn't the best fuel. Anyways, I'd like to thank you all for watching, and uh, any suggestions is welcome. With that said, see ya! This is just more of a smoke bomb than anything else. I mean, all this work for nothing. Okay. Let's go get angle.